Uh, Carolina Reaper mash is the third ingredient. <laughs> I think I messed up. How'd you mess up? I had spicy stuff for lunch, like less than six minutes ago. Dude, I had tacos for lunch and I put some elevated on there from growing home and boy, it lit me up. But I had something called blazing broccoli. Blazing broccoli? Is that soup or is Kind it... of. That sounds delicious. It was, it was okay. It was okay? Okay, today we are taking on the epic the beef jerky challenge. Okay. I have no idea. I am going to, I'm going into this with some, let's see here. I'm, I'm going into this cocky. That's what I'm gonna do, that's how I'm playing. Okay. I'm going in cocky. I don't think it's gonna be that big of a deal. Okay. I don't think it's gonna be that bad. Well, I'll go in reserved. Okay, you think it's gonna be, <laughs> I don't know. I have to, no. I, I mean, just by the look of it a little bit. Okay, so I opened, I opened mine for the thumbnail, okay? If anybody doesn't believe me, don't watch my videos. I'm trying to fake anything here. So this is the jerky. That's in it. Let me put on this. The desiccate. The desiccate. Get, get that out of the way. Let me make sure I got everything out of this bag because I'm going to eat everything in the bag. Everything in the bag is going down. Okay. So this is the beef, this is the beef jerky challenge at gmail.com. <laughs> that is who makes this. Uh, distributed by the Smokehouse Jerky Company from Hemet, California. I don't think I've ever had jerky from them. Um, it says, so it's, let's see here. I'll try to lay it out there. So it says, the Beef Jerky Challenge, extremely hot. It's made with Carolina Reapers. Um, there isn't like a, uh, like directions or anything like that. So I say we eat it, and then we're going to do a, eat it. We're going to do like a five minute afterburn, basically. Okay. So just hang out for five minutes. Talk about it. Talk about it. There's no liquids or anything for five minutes to see how it goes, okay? Okay. Um, it is a half ounce piece. Uh, Katie's beef jerky, that the, her beef, her flaming ass beef jerky challenge was a one ounce piece that had an extract on it, which made me cramp so hard. Okay. This is a half ounce. Half ounce, no extract. No extract. But the ingredients, uh, beef teriyaki sauce. It's gonna be kind of hard because there's like a million ingredients in this, so I gotta like separate it, like the parentheses yeah. out of this. Uh, beef teriyaki sauce. Um, uh, Carolina Reaper mash is the third ingredient. Which is Carolina Reapers and vinegar, then cayenne, uh, pineapple juice, uh, absorbic acid, Worcestershire sauce. Is that how you say that? Yeah, I think okay. so. Uh, lemon juice, lemon emulsion, sodium benzoate, oh, granulated garlic, ghost pepper, ground pepper, sea salt, and ginger. This actually sounds pretty good. I think it's gonna be good. Uh, I just think it could potentially rock me. You think so? Potentially. It all depends, man. So I'm thinking, so, <laughs> all right. You got a fresh reaper right here, and you got a, I don't even know, like a diced and sauteed reaper down here. Or okay. a pickled reaper down here, or something like that. The second that you start, you remove it from that fresh pod, and you start doing stuff to it, it starts losing its potency, okay? okay. And they're using the mash, so basically they took, they took beef jerky and they mixed the mash in with a soy sauce, okay? And then they dried it, and that's how they made this beef jerky, generally speaking. Okay? Okay. And with the other ingredients, they tossed it all in there. So this mash is just kind of coating it, but I don't know how much mash they used. You know, this is by weight. It looks like a lot. So this is me talking smack on that. This, this is, is me. extremely... <laughs> this is me going cocky into this. Lightweight, educated oh, guess. Okay, uh, open yours, man. You can put it out on the, on the board here. We can have a... Line of demarcation here. We separate our challenge from left to right. Get the desiccate out of the harem. Keep your jerky on your side. Yeah. That's Yours looks thinking. darker than mine. Yes, that's significantly They look darker. completely different. They do. Like, mine looks really powdery. Yours looks very soy saucy. Mo more moist. And more moist. And your, I can see seeds. There's a lot more seeds. It seems like there's more seeds than yours, oh, too. Mine is, mine is empty. I cleared mine out. Okay. I'm doing the full challenge. Nice. All right, man. Might as well just start to get Sure. Yeah, just start chew on YouTube for two minutes. I know, right? I'll try to make... If, if the chewing noises get... Okay. I taste soy sauce immediately. Yeah, it's very sweet. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's good jerky. It's kind of a, a more tender jerky. Absolutely, that's what I prefer. If you like your jerky like that. Starting to get some heat. A little bit of heat. I haven't been nervous about a video in a while until this one. Are you nervous right now? A little bit. 
little bit. This is um pretty good jerky. It is really good. <coughs> Here's my last. Now I need to get <coughs> all this down. Not up my sleeves. I'm even gonna eat a couple of your seeds here. I couldn't get it to pick up. So it's building a little bit. It's very slow build. Very slow. Very build. slow build. Out of ten, what are you sitting at right now? A half. A half point five. Yeah. I'm at like a point five right now. Mm. Um, it. <clears throat> okay. First of all, breaking down. Spoiler: five minute after burn is not going to necessarily be a thing. Um, but no. So the, the quality of the jerky is delicious. Um, oh, this is this is definitely. Extremely high quality. Yeah, if you like jerky, depends how you like your jerky. Some people like a tougher consistency to jerky, and so you start chewing on it and it starts loosening up and things like that. And this is a very, very tender, like oh, fall yeah. apart yeah. beef jerky. Um, you get a big sweetness from the soy sauce. It's got that teriyaki flavor. Yep. You know, so it's like a teriyaki jer jerky. It's got a little bit of heat. It's you know? it, it is an extremely slow <clears throat> build. It's a very pleasant heat. Yes, yes. So it's it, not killing me. It's all mouth. I'm not feeling throat burn. Nothing like that. It's just a mouth burn. Yeah. Slow ramp. Absolutely. Very slow ramp. Absolutely. So, um, as far as like a a jerky challenge, I would not say that this is a jerky challenge for a person that I would that I would say is. I'm not trying to say that I'm like on the extreme side for a person who is. Love spicy food, eat spicy food all the time. I would not consider this to be a jerky challenge. But if you have little kiddos at home, or you have like somebody who's like I don't know, like in the like ten year old range or something like yeah. that, and you got a little kid who wants to like your you know, one of your kids wants to like try some sort of like spicy challenge. Yeah, you know, like this is a very good intro to somebody who um, new new to the game, new to spicy new to the game, food, new to spicy food, yeah. new to these kind of things. Um, you know, it's it's got it's got the. The, you know the wording, the, the beef jerky challenge. Somebody's gonna, you know, somebody's young. They're gonna feel good about themselves for taking down this challenge. You know, and yep. it does have a bit of heat. It's it's still building. It is actually still building. Yeah, it's building. It's building a little bit. I might be at a one, one point five now. I'm at. I, I'm still like at a point five. Probably. I'm. I'm maybe at a one, one point five. Like I could go on with my day right now. It does have the. Um, like the indicative Carolina Reaper burn, though. So I always, I, I've said it a million times on my channel. I, I feel like the, the Reaper burn is an internal burn. It's a throbbing burn. It's not that, uh, that's it's not that uh, scorpion or that habanero like stinging. No, like, it's like, like a burn that almost feels like it's got its own pulse. Yeah, it's it's a very internal one. You know, like those hot yep. burns. It's like a sunburn, like a twisted sunburn yep. or something like that. That's that like super painful, yep. lighter kind of burn. This is that internal one. It's very indicative of that, but it just happens to be happens to be a more muted version of that burn. Um, but I will say, um, quality of the jerky, flavor of the jerky, fabulous. Oh, absolutely, yeah. absolutely. As as a uh, as a jerky challenge, I would not really necessarily put it in there, but um, but a very good representation of extremely well, a very good representation of spicy jerky. Yep. You know, like a good yep. spicy jerky quality, product. Quality spicy jerky, entry level yeah. challenge, maybe something like that. If the, if if this was called. Carolina Reaper beef jerky. If that was the labeling they went on this, I'd be like, this is a fantastic yep. version of Carolina Reaper jerky. Yep. It's got the right burn. It's perfect like that. But as far as a beef jerky challenge, it just does not kind of, it does not, it doesn't, uh, it doesn't step up quite enough. It could be quite a bit hotter. Oh, yeah. But, um, comically hot. You could get, make it comically hot. You could hot. make it comically hot, and I kind of want it to be there. If they would have taken uh, Reaper powder and crusted this thing Reaper powder, this would have been... Put the rockin'. mash on it, then put the powder to hold on Absolute, into the mash. Absolutely, been rocking, just yeah. lit us up. Would have been a fantastic challenge. Maybe a higher qua quantity of yeah. Reaper. Yeah, something like that. The mash. Yeah, I don't know exactly what the quantity of the Reaper mash was on here, but yeah. Anyways, fun stuff, good stuff. Um, I'll put a link in the description below if you guys want to check this out. Justin, you're on the channel all the time. What do you want to look at? Instagram. Instagram always. Instagram, Instagram, Instagram. yet again. All right. Instagram. So in the in the link in the description below will be a link to Justin's Instagram, dude. The clip that you filmed last week that we were waiting on, are you going to put that up? I am. I think that'll probably go up really soon, and then I actually have my research going up soon, too. Even better. All right. That's well, going to be a good one. There's some, there's some cool stuff going up on Justin's <laughs> Instagram account, so make sure you go check that out. Um, regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed, um, and I'll see you guys on the next. 
Hey, this is Brian Ames. Uh, please click the subscribe button that you see right there, and uh, you'll subscribe to my videos. Uh, from now on, I'm going to be eating a lot of peppers. It's going to, oh man, it's going to be great. Bye.